so exhausted. I know you could tell I'm exhausted. Like, so yeah, this is a thing sometimes. I do reviews on Saturdays if there's no time during the week or if it's exam week and they don't want to bother us the day before our exams. So sometimes we have review sessions on the weekends, willpower. I don't know how I managed to do everything before this review session. So I woke up, I took a shower, I put on clothes, I took Walt out, I made myself breakfast, egg and toast. And I made myself coffee. And I knocked on the door to wake up Jackie so she could come too, because I know she wanted to come to the morning review session. But, um. Are you going to review? Um, I'll see you there if you're going. Bye. Bye. It didn't really go well. <laughs> um, I don't know if she's coming, but there's another review session in the afternoon, which I probably should have gone to too, but I mean, I just wanted to get it out of the way. So. Woo! Let's get this money. All right, I'm out. It is 12 o'clock, so we ended a little bit late, but we also started 15 minutes late because there were technical issues. I was gonna stay on campus to study in print, but I'm starving. So I am going home to eat. Usually on the weekends, my meal preps are gone, so I'll eat something out, typically a healthier choice, something I'm craving to just replenish myself, self-care, you know. But since I'm moving, I have to consume everything that's in my fridge because I'm driving in Tallahassee, so I'm gonna eat all my leftovers of whatever I have and just throw something together. It is 83 degrees. Look how beautiful it is. This is literally the perfect day to just be in a pool. And I'm gonna be studying all day, probably indoors, so this is gonna suck. I busted a whole you just to take a video of this. I'm literally crying! This is so cute! Hey y'all, so I'm taking a quick study break. I'm eating dinner actually, a little early, but I ate at 12, so now I'm like starving. Someone posted on Instagram, Oh, hit up this girl in Tampa, she's cooking, and she had posted like a menu, and she made wings, ribs, mac and cheese, baked beans, cornbread, banana bread, it sounds pretty good. Plus, I remember when I was in Tallahassee, I used to make empanadas, and like I used to sell them, so I knew what it was like, of like having people support you, so I was like, I'm gonna see what this is about. I got lemon pepper wings, baked beans, cornbread and mac and cheese banana bread dessert I'm definitely not gonna eat this in one sitting I'm really excited to see what it tastes like I'm also kind of nervous because I don't even know the girl but that's the worst thing that can happen right the mac and cheese is good baked beans are good but they're good they're really good there you go that's my review <laughs> of this sketchy of somebody cooking in their kitchen. Fire. My dad is so cute. He knew I was stressing these tires because you know when you go to a car shop and they try to sell you everything? They're like, oh, the car filter. Oh, there's a bug on your windshield. We need to change it. You ran over some poop. We need new tires. I don't know the difference between a good brand and a bad brand. I don't know, like, stuff usually costs so i just really didn't want to look for these tires my dad found them in miami and he's gonna bring them up to me next week so i'm really happy about that he's the best isn't he so cute you know me you know i love banana pudding banana bread banana nut muffins like bananas my thing this cake oh it's so good it's so good so good. I want to cry. Library run because I need to get my printing in. Walter's, of course, sniffing every bush on the way. Come where? I'm oh starting to feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Grant's jealous. I thought it was working. Walter's we have therapy. the same skin. <laughs> totally got it. <laughs> That's wonderful. Walter's a professional. He's so cute. Solving everybody's problems. I think I should get a dog. Walter's just doing his duty of providing therapy for everybody. <laughs> Probably gonna get some avocados and some dish soap at Walmart. Then we're gonna go home and continue to study. Headed to 
to bed because I want to wake up at 6. That's the goal. So I can get through the rest of Neuro and a head start on Fizz. Good night. I didn't wake up at 6 in the morning, but I woke up at like 10. And I started studying. It's been productive, but I'm going to take a study break and bathe Walter because he needs a bath. He's not excited. <laughs> Y'all, it's getting to that point in the night where I'm so tired and I don't want to do anything. So I'm just taking a break. She's stressing. So tired. So much to do, so little time. <laughs> so tired. It's exam day. Walter and I are going on a Starbucks run because my coffee at home isn't that strong. I need like some espresso to wake me up. I've gotten through all my Quizlets, so now I'm gonna do some practice questions and my practice exam. Y'all, yeah. this is so good. Thank you. You too. Woohoo! Walter, you like Starbucks? <laughs> Fun fact, I actually used to work at Starbucks on campus at FSU. Strozier Library, RIP to my soul, because we always were so busy. You know how people usually work at food places? They never go back ever again, like they get sick of it. I'm not that person. I love Starbucks. I worked at Cold Stone before that, and I love <laughs> Cold Stone. You should be happy about where you're working at because you go there every single day. Yeah, I really enjoy the places I worked at. Exam time, so I'm heading out, Walter. Send me good vibes, wish me luck. Okay, okay. Ow. Dripping and finesse. Don't make no sense. Hey, I'm on my way home. I just got out of my exam not too long ago. I expected it to be a little bit easier. No time to be stressing all oh, <laughs> exams that are already done and over. And now I'm headed back home. I'll probably take a short break and get back into studying. My dad is supposed to come tonight, so that's gonna cut out some of my studying time, but it's my dad, so I have to make an exception. <laughs> okay, uh, so I'm making dinner. I'm making whole wheat pasta, spaghetti sauce, turkey, while I'm studying, because I gotta multitask. I have overslept ridiculously. My dad didn't end up staying last night, so I was able to study till really late. I ran a few errands, and now we're getting Starbucks again because, it's because. <laughs> so yeah, then we're heading home and back to the cave to study more and more and more. Guess who got Walter a puppy Chino? Oh my God, I'm gonna spill this thing. Oh my God, I just spilled this puppy Chino on my pants. <laughs> For everyone that's wondering what a puppy Chino is, it's just whipped cream in a cup but dogs love it oh yeah i ordered a caramel macchiato and yesterday when i got the caramel macchiato i felt like there wasn't enough caramel drizzle in it today i was like oh, i'm gonna ask for extra drizzle but i feel like today they were like oh you want extra drizzle okay i'm gonna give you extra drizzle like look at this and then there's walter Good morning! I've actually been up since like 5 something, but I played myself. Right when I got up, I was really cold. Decided to stay like in my sheets in my bed, which I, I don't know why I thought I would be able to be productive. And I even made myself coffee. That's the funny part. I start doing my Quizlet, and then I lose consciousness. <laughs> For like an hour, I just passed out like... And I woke up because my big sister called me. I told her to call me at 7. 
um, just in case I had not been awake. And she called me and she was like, are you still sleeping? And I'm like, no, I'm awake, I'm awake, why? And she was like, okay, I'm just making sure. Hang up, I go back to study my Quizlet, I pass out again. She literally called me back in 30 minutes and she was like, hey, have you jumped in the shower? And I was like, <laughs> what? I have not jumped in the shower, I'm gonna jump in now. No, but really, when, when she called me the second time, I was like, I need to get out of here. So I jumped in the shower, I got all my stuff, I made myself breakfast, and I'm out. I'm going to campus because I'm a little too comfortable in my room. I'm not getting anything done, and I have this exam at 2 o'clock. This coffee didn't do anything to me, and I'm really annoyed because I took the time yesterday to go buy it. thing, And I'm not going to spend more money today on buying Starbucks coffee because bought it two days in a row wish me luck i literally have like five hours till this exam pray for me y'all i paid <laughs> okay. i caved i caved so hard starbucks is on the way to where i'm going if there's a long line i'm not gonna go but there was like no line, so I would. Uh, God is on my side today. He's on my side every day, but I found parking in the first try, uh, right where I need to go. It's a great day. It's a great day. I'm on my way to my exam. As you can see, I'm super nervous. My face is super red, but whatever. I study what I study. Hopefully it goes well. Hey y'all, so I just got out of my exam like 20 minutes ago. I think it went okay. I don't know, I'm a little nervous. There's a lot of questions that I've been trying to see if I got them right. I have to go to my leasing office for my apartment because I have to fill out paperwork for my sublease. Then I have to be at Pep Boys by 4 for my appointment to change my tires. I gotta eat because I haven't ate. Life is, life is a little like, hectic right now, but we're gonna make it through. So tires are fixed. It went well. They didn't try to hustle me or anything. Thank God. I got a little head start on my Quizlets for farm. I was literally studying at the car shop because they took like two hours. They didn't take my car back until five o'clock when my appointment was at four o'clock, but of course I digress. So I met up with my dad and now we're heading back to the apartment. My dad is going to take a nap and shower and then we're gonna go eat and enjoy the rest of the day. Walter is so upset because He's been home all day since when I left this morning. He's been holding that thing in for I don't know how long. <laughs> so this is my dad. Happy say hi. Hello. I'm already on campus. I'm gonna grind today. One more exam. Last night my dad slept over. It was pretty funny because right before we went to sleep, he's like, you don't snore, right? And I'm like, no, I don't snore. I lay my head down and he starts snoring. It was like, it was intense. I slept on the couch. I couldn't do it. I just left the library. I was there since seven in the morning. It's 3.30 and I'm starving. I brought like a snack with me, but I honestly didn't pack a lunch, but I'm trying to save money. So I'm gonna go home, make myself food, make myself more coffee, and there's a review session at five. And I'm probably gonna go to dinner with my dad and then spend the rest of the night just going through my Quizlets and all of tomorrow morning just going through my Quizlets. Hopefully by then I will be prepared for my exam. Hello. Where are we eating? My, this is my dad's favorite place. <laughs> Good morning. I've been up since like 5.30 studying, but today is move out day and my last exam. I'm super excited. Look at my room. It is completely I spent the morning cleaning it out, putting everything in my car, and cleaning my bathroom, cleaning my room. I still have to vacuum, but my roommate is sleeping, so I'm gonna wait. My shelf, and this is all that's left. And now I'm studying, and I'm dead, and I'm so tired. I'm still going through my Quizlets, but 
one more exam, six hours until my exam, and I have to go to downtown to pick Nat up. I got her a, a train ticket here, and I'm gonna pick her up at the station. And I'm gonna go to my exam, take my exam, and then we're in Tallahassee. So I'm on my way to downtown Tampa. I, as you can see, I'm really anxious about my exam, but I can't be upset with myself because all I've done is study. So <laughs> whatever happens, happens at this point. Seven, I just dropped Nat off at the apartment. Now I'm going into my exam. Literally, my exam starts in like 10 minutes. It's gonna go well, positive vibes. The last exam, finally. Let's get this money. I am free! <laughs> I'm so happy. Not gonna lie, that exam was pretty hard, but at this point, like, I'm pretty confident that I passed. I don't know what grade I got, but as long as I pass, at this point, that's what matters. <laughs> we had a pizza party. I grabbed some pizza for myself and Nat. Nat is waiting for me at the apartment. And I said bye to my roommates. I'm so sad. I actually really liked my roommates, so I am sad and they're sad, but it's okay. We're gonna link up again and Yeah, we're gonna pack up Walter and head to Tally <laughs> so, Quick update I went to Andrea's graduation Grace's graduation Carissa's graduation then I drove down from Tallahassee today, just made it to Miami, and then I'm going home changing and heading to Lorenz graduation party. And that'll wrap up my shenanigans and let me start my break officially. Thank you for tuning in. Subscribe, like, I hope you enjoyed this video and look out for future videos. Thank you. <laughs>